Hello and welcome back to part three of Star Fox Adventures, and we are sorry for the delay on this one. Well, we had some complications on both of our uh, both of our parts, and that ship. Yeah. I'd rather not explain the complication on my part, but uh, just it's mostly Christmas stuff, some personal stuff, but eh, whatever. Speaking of Christmas, we're in the Ice Age. Yes. Or just yes, on snow. Yes, perfect timing on this episode. We're in winter and we're in Ice Mountain. And smack. <laughs> uh, animal abuse and child it's abuse. It's not animal abuse. They're already dead. Child abuse. Huh? Still, that's BS. <laughs> I got you on that one, you uh -huh. bastard. Okay, so basically the gist of this is in order to get the switch to open that door, you have to kill two sharp claws. Where are they? Right here. And we have a timed explosive. Still can't believe you can't bring a blaster because God forbid there's explosives not on the planet. There are many times in this game where a blaster would have been so useful. And these are, and as you can see, these sharp claws are blue. Because apparently blue sharp claw can go into freezing for some reason. Apparently. I don't know how that works. I have no, I uh, they're dinosaurs. We're cold blooded. Uh, this is like the shortest level. Isn't this like the shortest level, basically? Oh, he almost got hit. Yeah, I almost. <laughs> the hit detection is so off in this game sometimes. There's a cloud runner. Oh, by the way. Two clouds. By the way, this next part we're playing, I lose the first time. I, l I hate this part of the game. Smack. <laughs> <laughs> I love their laughs. <laughs> and Fox is not brightest moment. I am Fox McCloud. Fox, do these people look like anyone you'd want to reason with? Smack. Okay, seriously, they're getting smacked with clubs. How the heck is there not blood or scratches? Because there can't be. This is Nintendo. Oh, BS. Oh, yeah, they, they, they have problems blowing up a brain in 64. Ah, you may have a fair point. Oh, uh, God, I hate this part of the game. I hate this part. This, I hate this legit. This made me want to quit the game because I could not beat it so many times. The controls are so bad in this part. I'm not going to lie. It's not. Once you get used to it, it's just meh. Right. Once you get used to it, it's fine. But it's been a while since I played it, so I'm terrible with this. And this is why I lose the first time. Bombs. They're... Uh, I'm never. I'm not good at racing games, and I was not expecting this when I played it. Racing. I'm good at. I'm fine with racing games, especially. The only racing game on the GameCube I was ever good at, and that was only Sonic Riders. Uh, I don't like Sonic Riders. I like the game. I don't know. I had maybe it's because I kind of suck at racing wow, games. Wow, you suck. It, it may be because I kind of do suck at racing games sometimes, except the one I'm playing now, All Stars Racing Transformed, which is awesome. But uh. I don't know, it's just something about the controls on riders didn't I didn't like, and the controls on the speeder bikes on this really suck. I'm not they they feel awkward. I can't believe stop drive you're driving why are you oh, never mind. Oh, yeah, <laughs> I'm driving early. this drunk. Apparently. That's a shortcut, but you failed it by crashing into him. Uh, I could have seen And succeeded. this is why and this is why I hated the game. Hi! He can just crash into them! And smack. I wasn't trying to lose, but I was hoping to, so I could just see. <laughs> so I was hope because I was hoping Jose would suffer in some way. And I forget fuel cells over here, like an idiot. Yeah, that's like probably the only benefit of actually uh, losing. Losing just to get that back. Right, you can go back to Ice Mountain if you wish, but I don't backtrack a lot in this game unless I have to. But yeah, there's like a. Uh, I really that's the reason why I hated this part of the game because it felt like the game was just mocking you. It's like. Hey, hey, I'm blocking your exit. You're gonna get punched now. And Fox doesn't bother to do anything. Apparently, he's just... He could have just jumped off the bike and let it crash into them. Wait a minute. Speeder bikes? Alien planet? Shut up. <laughs> I cannot resist. I'm going to say it. Return of the Jedi. Uh, I hate you. <laughs> uh, but... But anyway, there's like actually like two ways of doing it. LJ's doing it the legit way, which is basically get to the end while also cr trying to crash into them just for the heck of it. Because explosions make me happy. And the second way of doing it is is the brake check way. Basically, 
get in front of them, get to and as tunnel. soon as you get into a narrow tunnel, like this one right here, just break it, and you just and they just slam into their deaths. Yeah, which is just awesome. That makes it the entire race easier. Right. If you manage to destroy both speeder bikes during the race, it makes the entire thing easier, and you're just it's smooth sailing from there. And yet somehow they still appear, even if you blow them up. Uh, yeah, that's one thing that doesn't make sense. That's why I like doing it the legit way Time for it. continuity's Time sake. It. Time it. It's a long fall. Humpty Dumpty sat on a wall. Humpty Dumpty had a great fall, and then Tricky laughed his ass off. And that was fairy tales with LJ. What? This music is troll music. <laughs> I, I, can't I, I heard Rodan. <laughs> I hate this thing. <laughs> Tricky, the Jar Jar Binks of Star Fox. Sent to rescue you. He's been captured. He's been captured? Right. Oh my god, uh, it's like listening to Silver. To oh, shut up. It's that bad. I'm not even joking. It's like listening to Silver's voice again. She'll be just fine. But we need it's to no use. If, if, uh. if Tricky says that, I'm out of here. Just saying. Uh huh. <laughs> but pretty much after. Now you just had to get Tricky home. Yes. Speaking of which, speaking of which, uh, last part I did not say what the heck my second, what uh, like the first problem I had. Yeah, you might as well which, say it while nothing's going on. Ooh, look, shrooms. Other, other than, oh yeah, this is basically uh, just a way to refill tricky. Yes, you give him drugs. That apparently are alive and moving. Mm -hmm. That's not sadistic whatsoever. All right, while I'm doing this puzzle, why don't you explain your second thing? Wait, and apparently they sleep. Apparently. How the hell do sh how the heck does shrooms sleep? Um, how do shrooms have eyes? Ask that to Mario. Ugh. Anyway, the uh, the problem I had from the second part, like the like the first thing I really shocked, like really like my first shock about the game, my very first shock for a video game was what Pe what Pepper was saying during his tutorial session about Slippy. Slippy is preparing a translator to Heist, but until it's ready, he'll translate for you. That's the thing! That's the first time they legitimately tell us what gender he is! Because I always assumed he was a woman! Yeah, because in Star Fox 64, he was voiced by a girl. And it's not like, you know, one of those girl voices where, okay, it's like he, she's voicing a little kid. Which, th th this voice wouldn't even work for that, and somehow Tricky teleported. Magic. But, yeah, it's like, you know, Slippy always sounded like a girl in 64. My my stepsister legitimately thought Slippy was a girl, and so did I until I played this game, and I was shocked. That's just... That makes it even more lame! <laughs> and, then, uh. and then when I played Star Fox Adventures and I told my stepsister, Slippy's a dude! <laughs> because I was a little kid at the time, so this was all shocking to me and stuff. She didn't believe me at all. Yes, the shrooms are tasty. Yes, the shrooms. There's something near. Oh, guys, like Navi. Oh, four <laughs> legs. It's yeah, it's like a combination of Jar Jar Banks, Silver, and Navi. It's a AKA the worst combination ever. Crawl. We're in hell. Da -da -da -da. And now welcome to Snowhorn Wastes. Yes, fight the sh Oh, that guy. Oh, that's awesome. Oh, you screwed it up. I'm sorry. It, I'm just used to pre to button mashing in this game. I, I you, you don't you don't have to. You just screwed up a perfectly good combo. Right, yeah, I do it. Yeah, I do it right later. But um, really, you can do those moves if you want by like you know, using the control stick and the um, A button. But it's not required because really, all sharp claws. What the heck is that thing? It's. Oh my. Would you shut up about that? <laughs> it's a penis and it's alive. Like the shrooms, apparently. Yes. And now, and look at the shark in the background chasing Tricky. Smack. Smack. But yes, the. But yes, the shrooms. They actually look rather phallic now that I think about it. 
How so? Just, just look at them. They, the tips, they look like. Oh my god, are you kidding me? <laughs> are you kidding me? <laughs> I have just disturbed Jose's mind. I'll see him in therapy. Oh, you want, oh, you want uh, disturbing images? Mm. Wait till later. What are you talking about? You'll see. No. Hunting shrooms. Other than that, hunting shrooms. Fine. Yes. And also, and also uh, the first upgrade of the game. Well, no, the first upgrade was the uh, fire blaster. This is the first. That doesn't count. That was a power up. This is the that, right. That's this, a power up. Oh, right. This is an upgrade. Yeah, the, oh, right. There's a difference. Uh, but yeah, this is the first cave we find in the game that increases your staff energy. You can tell us. The, you can tell the difference between the caves because of the fact the ones with the power ups have water. This one has none. Yeah, exactly. And really, I like these caves a lot because I like having a lot of staff energy. It really helps. Especially when you get the, especially when you get the more powerful. Oh yes. Power up. Especially when your staff becomes more destructive. But we'll get to that later. I'm flying. I'm Jesus. <laughs> you have a fox. You're the raptor. That's right. There's a fox, Jesus. You're the raptor, Jesus. Here's your fox. <laughs> Jesus. That explains everything. That was the best thing you've said in this commentary so far. I'm sorry. For Look at those things. They're like running for their lives. Help me. No. I feel sorry for these phallic shaped mushrooms because, you know, they, they look so innocent, except that shut up wrong. Yeah. Fuck. I hate sitting through this animation. Eh. Okay. Look at. You got used to it in Legend of Zelda. Yeah, but that had a cool little tune that I just love. Wait, this doesn't? Eh, touche. And this is. Oh my. Look at that! Owls are shooting stuff at you when that thing's back. <laughs> Owls have, laser, have Star Wars laser blasters, apparently, out of their eyes. If you're gonna teleport, then, well, I wouldn't imagine. This place is just a mindfuck. This entire planet. And, and there's a woolly mammoth. And this is me. What are they called? Snowhorns? Yes, snowhorns. Huh. Dinosaurs and, dinosaurs and woolly mammoths is together in one place. Yep. Apparently. Oh my. Oh my god. Where are the Ice Age? Oh my god. Really? Yep. Yes, it'll go. Yes. Where's Manny, Diego, and Sid? Yes, we're in a world where one movie will be awesome, a second movie will be okay, but everything after that is so friggin' unnecessary. Where's Queen Latifah and Peaches? No, 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 no! That is where I'm drawing the line. <laughs> no. <laughs> no! <gasps> oh my god, it is Queen Latifah! <laughs> okay, then. <laughs> really, Queen Latifah, you've really let yourself, you've really let yourself go over the years. I'm a horrible person. Scarabs, yes, you are. You'll be able to buy many useful items. I sound like a Scottish guy on cigarettes. And scarab bag. You're a money holder. Yes, so now the scarabs won't- Now, instead of shoving your the scarabs in the fox's pockets, you're shoving them into a bag. Indeed. Where does he put the bag? Uh, I don't know. It's those kind of games. Where does- Yeah, it's like- It's one of those games where you wonder where he puts all these items. Oh, look at look at this fire extinguisher! What? <laughs> it's 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 like the question that Helsing Ultimate fa fans have: Where does Anderson put all his blades? Hmm. You really want to know? I really don't. Good. I don't want to know. Order. Know where anyone puts these things in these games and series? I'm actually kind of curious. Does the shopkeeper accept dead scarabs or alive scarabs? Because you're shoving them into a bag. I highly doubt you're. I highly doubt 50 scarabs are gonna be alive in that in a one single bag. Yeah, there's probably gonna be a huge case of claustrophobia. This is a block. I'm gonna grab now some fuel it. cells. Hut, 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 hut. Hut, hut, hut. <laughs> that reminds me when we were playing Halo 4. Move it, move it, move it. We might have to do a playthrough of those games, like, you know, co co cooperatively after we're done with the Star Fox games. 
Depends. Grabbing him. Live it. Wait, what were you gonna say? Uh, nothing. I was just saying. And now he's in, he's in the ice. <laughs> Dinosaurs in ice. Are you gonna do your second Ice Age reference of this part? Not really. Shame. I already made my quota. Shame. Look at. Apparently, fire is magic. Because that was not that was not lit. I know, it just it's spontane I've looked at those fires and like, you know, like one time it was transitioning to light night and then suddenly that fire lit up. Apparently the fire is alive. And everything is alive. I blame the firebenders. Really? Yes. We're not uh You had your Ice Age reference. Let me have my reference to Avatar the Last Airbender. No thank you. Oh my god, Slippy! Your face! What happened to your face? Uh, oh god, that thing's back. Seriously, that thing should not be alive! And for some reason, that final staff move did not hit him. It's... it's cold-blooded. It's sinking into snow. It should be dead. It's a penis. Would you shut up? <laughs> <laughs> and those scarabs just went to me after I lifted up the rock. An odd little glitch. Open it. I think that's set up for later, correct? But, no, that platform... You do have to come across this later, but if you have that platform activated, you can get a couple fuel cells. Huh. Oh, no, I haven't played... Like I said, I haven't played this game. Since, like... Blue Snowhorn! release. Yes, there's a blue snowhorn in this game. Like, I... I did not see it. Yeah, I, I... I barely saw him, but yeah, you can see him. He's, uh... Yeah, that blue snow horn, in case anyone saw it, that comes into play later. This this music does sound very Ice Age like. And if I remember correct if I remember correctly, that has an extra life, is doesn't it? Yes, a Baffum Dad. I wonder what that A Baffum Dad. This is a bathroom, Dad. It has four effing ears! Yeah, it's it's gonna hear everything. You're trying to whisper a secret to a friend? It will hear it. Wait, that's kind of... That's for, uh, I always thought those were, like, wings. That's how it got around. It might be wings, I, it might be ears, or it might be both. Maybe it's, like, Dumbo. I highly doubt it. It could be. Now that I actually got a clearer look at it. It, it's possible, I guess, because they are fairy creatures, I think, according to the thing. The way they're fairies? I think. I need to... Okay. Anyone in the comments, if you played this game before, could you please tell us if, like, the Baffum Dads are supposed to be fairies? Because I don't want... Okay, I call so much BS on this. <laughs> because I found it before you ever did. Uh, I literally... I can actually turn the camera around. <laughs> this area, I can never find this area. Another one. I can't collect it because I don't have a bathroom dad holder. That's the. Oh my god, that also reminds me. You're stuffing little. <laughs> you're stuffing little creatures into a bag. They're not just any creatures, they're fairies! <laughs> Crocker would go. Why do you make these references? <laughs> because I love references. Apparently. <laughs> but anyway. <laughs> But anyway, I can never find the area. I literally looked everywhere, but I can never find it. I just... It annoyed the hell out of me. I just went around the wall and looked at the inventory and waited for Tricky's fine command to flash. That's how I found it. Ugh. Darn it! You're missing shrooms. This is a good point. You're giving a dinosaur shrooms. What the hell is he saying? Oh, hi. A bribe claw. These things do not fight you. They just guard places, but if you give them money, they'll give you easy access from now on. Or, the, in this case, the only access. Mm -hmm. There's two of them in this game. One you have to pay, but the other doesn't appear until much later. And I'm going to show you how you can get away with not paying him. Just like in every video game, bats! Bats! Or, in this case, fire bats. I hated these things. Meh. I hate, I hate the freaking demon bats more. Demon bats? Remember? Oh, those things had laugh. Oh, those things. I, I, I didn't think they were bats. I just thought they were. I don't even know what to call them. Look at the 
Yeah, they're running for their lives. You're just whacking them on top of the head. We don't want to die. And we will use this in passageway, but the water's leading us to Thorntail Hollow already. We will show you how to get back when we need to. And look at him, tr look at Tricky swim. I had no idea the dinosaurs could swim. It looks like he's spazzing out. <laughs> he's barely keeping his head off the water. <laughs> uh, I didn't know Tricky could swim, but barely, but... I had no idea dinosaurs could swim at all. Except the ones that, you know, only stay in water. Yeah, it's... Really? Really, game? You're questioning my logic? I play Sonic, for God's sake. I know I'm devoid of logic, so really, I'm accepting anything at this point. Open the gate. That's my mom! How did he land on his Don't feet? Don't question it. Better yet, how the hell can we hear her? Sonic logic. I know this is a Star Fox game, but that's my... Demon Bat! That's my answer to everything. And also, Shark Claw, apparently. Oh, you dick. I hate when they I hate when they do that. Yeah, it's a dick move. It's, like, it's, a, free, it's a free extra hit. Until they die. It also... I think one time I was playing this game, and, like, I had, like... I was, like, I had only one bit of health left. And then I ran across a Shark Claw, and he did that friggin' headbutt move, and I died. Anyway. Did you just say paddywhack? Yes. I don't... What is this? I don't eat... I don't know how to respond to that. Then don't. I'm here, guys. Mission accomplished. How the hell is it accomplished? You did nothing, you lazy ass. She is gonna be okay, isn't she, Fox? Are you sure you She looks like she's dead. planet's not back together yet. The queen needs my help. Fox out. Is there anything we can do for her? Get her more we shrooms, of course. White grub tops. No, we're My not even kidding. That's how you that's how you heal her. Well. You get shrooms. It looks like she'll Apparently need there's three different kinds Let's of shrooms in this world. See what we can find. The red ones, the white yeah. ones, and the wait. Red? White? Blue? Don't. <laughs> I never but anyway. I never noticed that. So the blue one. Edible. The the white ones. Apparently they heal you. And the red ones. They make you see things. <laughs> I see dead people. I like how like I like how their bodies just disappear to like they don't their body just doesn't hang around. Kind Smack. See? Are they That's annoying. Yeah, are they no bodies or something? Do they just disappear when they die and don't even die at all? I'm kinda so, I'm kinda sad you don't do the spin move anymore. I might do it in later parts, but I don't know. It's kind of what I really, what I really want to see is where Fox just jumps in the air and just holds the staff up. Oh yes. I have a per I have a perfect line for that. Oh, I can't wait to hear it. So we're just collecting scarabs here because we need some money. Us. You're gonna need the lantern to go down into the well to get the shrooms because if you go down there and you don't have the lantern, this old Yoda like Thorntail will tell you to fuck off basically. Go buy the lantern. <laughs> there, you need to light your way. <laughs> go and see the shopkeeper. He'll he'll help you out for the right price. What? Do you... Remember the? Did you elite? Uh, did you uh dig that one place up? What place? Oh, uh, if there's a hole in front of the uh, uh, shopkeeper. No, I didn't because I want to get the Baffum Dad holder whenever I do that. It's before. Oh I... wait, there's a ba there's another there's another one down there. You need to get no. It's like I'm not talking about scarab holders. There's Baffum Dad holders. That's the one over there. Basically, until you get it, you can only carry one Baffum Dad at a time. That's still so more. That's still so sadistic. <laughs> You're stuffing little fairy creatures into a bag. <laughs> And I hate him. You cannot bargain with him. That's too low. That's too low. If you, if you try, okay, it'll, it'll be like one dollar off. That's pretty much it. But if you go beyond that, it's like, oh, you're crazy. <laughs> I think the only time I ever got a good bargain was with the uh, golden alpine root. I think I. You go. Go ahead. I think I actually the first time playing it, I got a good deal on it. 
if you try, it's it's impossible to go to half price. Oh yeah, and we're getting annoying. And we're getting this thing because I love it so much. And plus we I hate I hate him. That's your that's yours to begin with. Like like you said, mine, mine, mine. Okay, Apparently. Oh god, god that sure. tail disturbs me. I seriously wanna kick I seriously wanna kick his ass. He doesn't have an ass. That's yours! He doesn't have an ass, Jose. He has a tail. Exactly. And that's the better question. How do you think he pees or poops? <laughs> what? Think about, it. think about it really carefully. Oh my god. You are a horrible, horrible person, and I am displeased to know you. Worse, yeah. What if he had to do it at the, at the exact same time? Oh! <laughs> His Oh! His, tail just, his tail just aims to the ground and it just splits. Oh! My god, Jose! Worse yet, what if he leaves a trail? Oh! <laughs> I am going to eat your soul! And we're reaching uh -huh. the end of this part. Uh, you're gonna have to give me some time to wipe my memory of all that I just heard in the last minute. And you will be by staying. And um. If you'll okay, excuse me, I'm gonna go kill Jose. My mom See y'all. Peace out, people.